National coalitions in the field of transparency condemned the arrest of Aziz Oridov. In response to the recent detention of Aziz Orijov, director of the independent internet TV Channel 13 and a member of the Council of the National Coalitions of Azerbaijan to increase transparency in the extractive industry and reveal how much you paid, both coalitions strongly condemned the arrest of council member Aziz Orijov and Rufat Muradli colleagues in Channel 13. A joint statement reads that the coalition considers these detentions as related to their independent and critical role in the media. The coalition expresses deep concern and emphasizes that the searches, especially in the presence of Orijov's children and the subsequent actions in his office, violate the principles of public administration and ethical behavior, representing a serious violation of moral norms. This action by the government is considered a flagrant violation of the Article 25 of the Constitution of Azerbaijan and Article 14 of the European Convention on Human Rights, which prohibits discrimination. The coalition notes that the arrest of Aziz Orijov under this article raises serious questions, especially in light of the numerous unregistered land developments in Baku and the Absheron district authorized by the executive and municipal authorities. Both coalitions share the concerns expressed by the country's public and international organizations in connection with these recent arrests. The coalition calls for a thorough study of the circumstances of Orijov's detention and calls for respect for freedom of the press and expression in Azerbaijan. On November the 28, 2023, Aziz Orijov was arrested by the police and a search was conducted at his place of residence, as a result of which various items were confiscated, including laptops, unused phones and documents. The next day, Orijov was charged under the Article 188.2 of the Criminal Code, violation of the right to own, use or lease land, during a court hearing in the Sabail District Court, which led to imprisonment for a period of three months. Orijov denies these charges, linking his arrest to his media and public activities.